you, with your emphasis on mathematics in your theory, you I would call you in some ways a Pyth Pythagorean or a, a, a Platonist, one who believes that the mathematical realities underlie the physical universe. Very much so. We actually argue that mathematics is as fundamental mm -hmm. in terms of existence as existence itself. That mathematics is not just some kind of way to get there, at some kind of calculation, uh, some kind of calculation that most people don't understand and absolutely disintegrate when you use that term mathematics. It is something far greater. We think that proof in mathematics is fundamental to our reality and that mathematics itself in that Pythagorean sense, maybe in that Platonic sense, is something extremely important. Mm -hmm. And of course, that is one linkage with Kabbalic mysticism, which has its own mathematics. Some would not say this is Kabbalah at all, which has its gematria where you can total mm -hmm. up things and find all sorts of interesting pieces of information, still very much disputed whether or not that is real or not real, and mm -hmm. control groups with Moby Dick in <laughs> different languages. doesn't matter. The point about it is certainly there are some mathematical elements, yeah. but there are some components of Kabbalah that certainly link up and possibly I could just talk a few about a few of those. Yes, indeed. Yeah. Well, fundamental to this idea of the triadic dimensional distinction, vortical paradigm, big word or big phrase, well, let's use it TDVP in future, mm -hmm. with the DD being 1D, yeah. but that's okay. Mm -hmm. Now, fundamental to that are three components. Component number one is consciousness, and certainly consciousness in Kabbalah might be reflecting a description of a divinity of a deity. Yes. Fundamental to the second component is dimensions. And in triadic dimensional distinction, vortical paradigm, we've described nine finite dimensions, not 10, not 15, not 26, not 8, not any other number, but 9 at that lowest level. It might be a multiple of 9 as well. It might be 81. Mm -hmm. It might be 729. Doesn't matter. The point about it is we are dealing with multiple dimensions. And most theories of everything break down just with the components pertaining to consciousness, and dimensions. Mm -hmm. Kabbalah, it's interesting, um, they are a group of what some would call dimensions, but I'm not yeah. sure if it fits our de definition of dimensions, which are measurable. Mm -hmm. And it might be measurable over space, time, and consciousness. Mm -hmm. And they're the so-called uh, ten spherot, yes. of which you are really dealing with nine, nine different qualities of humanity. Mm -hmm. So, for example, you have uh, what would be called the Chabad components, Chokhmah, which is wisdom, mm -hmm. Vina, which is understanding, Dat, which, uh, uh, Vina, which is knowledge, Dat, which is, uh, well, it's also knowledge, but mm -hmm. the Vina is the understanding component of it. You're talking now about what the, uh, is commonly known as the tree of life in right. Kabbalah. We're talking about yes. that tree of life yes. and this sefirot yeah. in relation to that. These are, the sefirot are sometimes thought of as ten different emanations of God. Exactly mm -hmm. that, at that lower level. Mm -hmm. And in fact, if you want, nine different emanations all mm. dynamically rotating as we have yeah. with TDVP and interfacing with each other. It's just a question of are these emanations dimensional or are they not? Mm -hmm. And then you get to a tenth level yes. and variably one might talk about something like Malchut, which would be a kingdom or 
a component who, mm-hmm. in terms of royalty, it doesn't really matter again. But the point about it is that translates in, to our TDVP to the so-called transfinite reality. Mm-hmm. In other words, we're dealing with nine finite quantized dimensions. Mm-hmm. And the next quantized extension forever is the transfinite, something we talk about more when we discuss infinity. But bear in mind that these are all discrete little bits of information as opposed to an infinite continuity. Mm -hmm.